Hey guys, good night. I'm going to tell you what say. I'm going to come give you the next update. Three days now, I'm just like going to update. But I remember saying girl just have baby. I'm going to say the, 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 the bigness of the girl's face. I'm going to say, no man, look at my collarbone them. Jesus Christ. Let me tell you something. Let me tell you something. If you don't have jovial face, pick this up on a dry. If you don't strong, pick this up on a dry. Look at my collarbone them. Girl, collarbone did full right out. Now you can't empty one trailer load of water in there. My child sucked me right out. Even not leave it titty none tall. My mom tell me that the titty them did that. I'm going to try to wake them up. Not even. Jesus can't wait them like Lazarus. They are dead, 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 gone down a belly. I don't know what happened to me now. But my baby there. Yeah. Baby is here. Chachi Jir. Chach there. Watch him, watch him, watch him. And just want to hear my mouth to start with you. Anyways, today's story time is because people been asking me and keep asking me. Everybody have different experience when it comes towards Spanish Town Hospital. For me, maternity, labor and delivery different, and antenatal ward. So then call it, I don't want to get it mixed up. Where you have the baby and then after you recover for maybe a day or two, I think down there named labor and delivery. Upstairs you wake up and ward where, yeah. I think you need antenatal ward. Because I remember saying I'm new to this, I'm a new mother. Me at the first I go hospital, so I have to share my experience because people ask and remember I was hesitant to go to sp to go to Spanish Town Hospital. But me tell myself say me now I spend four hundred and a thousand and with my condition with my blood pressure and everything that took place with me and all long me did in a hospital. If me did go up at the at hospital them then not tell and them mostly Andrews them one of them good them good hospital eh? Me would have can't pay the bill. Me would have got put out a go for me. Me would have got big something or sell something or stretch out me and pay the 500 and 600 and add thousand. So me did tell myself, say, based on the fact, say, me still not live nowhere and me still have work to finish my house. Me never going to spend so much money if I have my baby. Remember, me did done tell you already. So we did bargain for done a Spanish done hospital, right? Thumbs up, fear is fear that we did this course. All right, when I first went down there in the night, the service was uh, them did kind of slack off because, as we tell you before, I was feeling pain from after eight and them admit me power ward after three in the morning. Doctor said he was going to give me um, some pain meds to ease the pain since I wasn't dilating yet, but I was feeling contraction. He send me pan ward, add me pan ward. Claim same never member for give me the pill them. They the meds them. So I would have given him a three out of ten for that. That was really suck off. I something could have maybe saved if I did something to save my life, you'd have said, Oh me never member for gear. So that did slack off. But at the end of the day we have to member say a public hospital, them tired, them not get paid well. Because at the end of the day you know, we have to look out for you. We, well, we are human and human rights and them because something so we can't get up and beat them like how we get up and with a beat the police and with a beat the taxi taxi man or whatever the case may be the police them up on the road people like we um civilly and we just sometimes we just disgusting and we just irritate them them are human like we get what me i say fine when it comes to some of the nurse you see some of the nurse them i don't know if them get annoyed with all the woman them ball and whoa nurse me a dead me all a tear out listen a mother like me listen everybody take pain different let me let me say hands down me not judge nobody me not turn on me off my head because now me feel a swordfish me not big enough so no can make one swallow and swallow me I'm a little bit and tiny now so no can swallow me up let me tell you something everybody take pain different but some of the women them down there go through them third them fourth them fifth pregnancy i want to still go down a hospital i want to ball for you all i want to underneath i want to go and i want to lick down the place when i went down there a woman where them said must be our second or third child that lady sent pressure stress to how she was behaving she helped run up my blood pressure i'm afraid to all women are ball and I want to hear the nurse them I say 
a woman third pregnancy and listen to a woman go on a young girl around there where dilate more than she and at them first picking and them now behave like how she a baby you know the woman stress, stress to the baby when the baby born the baby dead but then for rush the baby go to um upstairs to the nurse where the baby died sometimes we have to learn for breed and learn for follow instruction we know the pain terrible because as i telling you know, before i did not push but them send on six bag of um, pain for me and i was still not dilating and the the doctor using finger and dilate me to four centimeter i literally feel when him what my service like my cervix bust me feel the pressure bust in my head twice and uh, sometimes I, be, I feel like I always behave and will cause the nurse. I feel like I, that's why them treat us. So that's why them not look at me and we say, Oh, a baby that come and the nurse never come and me tell, say, tell her, say, baby, I come and she not come because how some woman behave down there and deal with them and the bad do with them and all them. And why? Me what's it clad? I experience it myself. And as a human, my stomach sick. Nurse uno have a jovial fear. Doctor uno have a jovial fear. Midwife whatever uno name uno have a jovial fear because I personally could not do it based on the reaction at with some with female because honestly means the first time mother forced me to feel pain at in my life so and all I did was talk to Jesus, cry out for Jesus little, beat my foot, beat any people them place. Don't get me wrong, my clot down down at hospital like I'm a father build that. My lay down side table like I'm a father build that. Me beat my foot coming on my own. I'm a quench my pain. I'm a talk to God. Because I know say when you behave loud and vulgar and boisterous, they don't look at you. It's when you behave calm. I think when you behave calm, so when them hear an outburst from you, them say maybe something wrong with the mother there. So them come to look. But when you behave boisterous and loud right through the labor and contraction i think even when the baby are come them just be them just think yeah overdo it that's what i think don't get me wrong one nurse did give me proper attitude because when we did uh, when we did come back from the anest anesthesia i don't remember i don't anesthetic anesthesia anest that's something there me, me never see my baby, so I keep on answer the one question over and over. My eyebrow them fish here, you know, soon come. Me keep on ask the question, the one question over and over and over. When my baby, they my baby, so maybe she get annoyed, but she no know, no say, is recover and recovering. And then my answer say, can I get some water? And she, no, you cannot drink water. You just come out of surgery. So she near me off my head, but fine. When I went upstairs now, antenatal, let me tell you this. My doctor, she nice your fat. I tell her say, after she finish, because my question, I know, I ask every question. I ask where my medication, them for what the dosage, what the side effect, I ask everything. So one I time I thought she was getting annoyed with me, but I don't think so. She's very nice. My doctor, very, very, very nice. Me even said to her, I said, you have a private firm for yourself, like a private doctor. And she said, she's going when she finish intern or something of the start i recommend her say please hope me because you are so nice and bear in mind say a doctor was she good pretty and i like it you don't say me david woman but she look good because some of the doctor them will go on down there don't look good cash me baby me no one them tea you know erfa my baby wake mommy baby mommy baby mommy baby mommy baby mommy baby you wake up mommy baby wow six years I talk bad you know something my little feet already you know Baby, mommy, baby, mommy, baby, mommy, baby. Mm. You yeah, wake up, mommy, baby. Mm. You yeah, wake up, mommy, baby. Yeah, call your grand auntie if you come, come feed you.
Mommy, I finish what I'm video here. Like, don't listen to mommy. Yeah? Yeah, more you shave my eyebrow, I soon finish. Don't go away now. Call her for Oh, yeah, we have, you come. Come for your grandchild. You yeah, make him buckle? No, I feel like I'm not going to get it. What time you make it? My last buckle, you know? No, don't. About two hours ago, don't. No, no, for so long. When you sleep and wake, oh, you yeah. don't see using. Oh, oh, oh. Just you can't so get that. Yeah, put back the warm, the warm, the hot water, make it warm. Don't give him, call him, don't like nothing cold. Don't give him, baby, no cold feet. Put hmm? back with water for warm. The water in a cake, in a thermos. You put in a thermos? Oh, oh yeah. Dead yeah. Stuck, yeah. Come from here. You want to look at come and help me with my child, me a dead stock. Look how long my child born. Go on your grandma. Big chest, you want. Say Yeah, guys. I'm obsessed with my baby, you know, I'm see with just a laugh, so. <laughs> Hey, hey, me feel good tonight. Me, 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 um, my auntie come and help, I help me with the messy boy. At night time, I don't sleep. It's stressing me. I tell you, no, for me restless nights, them. I do a story time for my schedule and all my baby sleep and whatever for him band to know. So, anyways, my doctor, very nice. The environment for me at the hospital, I don't like it. I cannot sleep in a light and everybody and anybody sitting like hospital, me no know. Something wrong with don't know. I don't like the environment any at all. Hospital is not for me. Me that grade hospital one out of ten. The bathroom is messy, the girl them nasty, them blood up the floor, them left the big old dirty pad them, them them skin them out and them through them night bin them and wrap them up. The me see her worm pan the, the, the bathroom sink. I could not be me. I have to get up a man time. I don't know all them stand up in the shower and make the water run and just touch them foot and be I could not wash up. I could not tidy in the shower. Me have to get up and wipe up with wipes. Me no shame for talk. I wipe up with wipes every morning. I wipes me have to use me no one nothing for me touch the way me I brush my teeth, my barely brush and catch the water cause worm was on the sink like it was shitty for me. The bathroom shitty. Zero out of ten. Me hear one of the porter come in one morning and she a cuss a girl in and she don't clean the bathroom and when me go in there, I still see the room. Two room when me see. Two black room when me see from me just come up. Me see pan the two there and she say she clean it and I mean about look pan she. And the girl them, the, the blood like you, you drop your clothes and the blood catch it and wipe it off. Me know the whole way I go through pain. Wipe it off. You're nasty. It catch the floor. Me go in there already. And it catch the floor. And I drop a piece of wipe. I drop a wipes. Use my toe. Wipe it up. And use my toe. Take up the wipes. And go put it in the bin. Because you know when you put wipes in a toilet. It clog it up. Me put it in the bin. That was nasty. You know, nasty. Bad. You know, sit in my stomach when you come to the bathroom. The nurse them, the whole of them get to know my name because I don't know say any wish for me. Oh, what if a woman from the ward didn't know me? Oh, my name must say me and cash famous. Oh, what if a girl from the ward didn't know us? I'm a walk around even though I get my cut. I walk them bust my belly by the time she. I walk around and then because of something, even though the whole of pain, it still walk so whole of people know me. More than 10 women with a baby down there know me. I mean, I exaggerate. Um. The nurse them nice. I sometimes a man tell me when they come and see me, them say them say, you know, Peter Gino got no me and whatever, whatever, and them nice I want them to give me medication and they were very nice. Doctor nice and nurse nice. Some of the ports are them nice. This one girl down there with your macabac fish she Mum hey, you see if I you see to all my ignorance, me a mad girl and me can't tell them say Jenna she a mad girl I change me a change. You see, if I never cut me, get a baby, they don't that, then I'll discharge me. My whole life, I want to try to bread with it on her ear, because I don't know who gets cut up on her ear for bread her head. And I'm going to the hospital with her down there, because she don't know who me. Me not eat hospital food. I know I, I don't eat hospital food. I can't eat at any restaurant. I can't eat any anyway. I have, have, have acid reflux, and at least the grease will go down my stomach. It costs me. The least I could grease will go down my stomach. 
it cost me a three day what I sleep. Burning sensation medication. People with acid reflux know the shrimps. Me nanny am hospital food. One man in them carry the food come and I said no thank you. Me, me asked them so what kind of tea you have and she said mint. The next girl down there didn't know me, she nice though. She said mint. I said give me the mint. Me said ah, she said yeah. Me said give me the mint tea. Me no want to eat. She said them don't make them sweet, them fresh. Me said cool. Me said don't give me the breakfast, but you name come up on your breakfast. So them realize that them about three breakfasts are three. I even time breakfast and lunch throw away for me. Cause I know one day I'm a oat meat and I tell you something. Not a me no know how them prepare that so that a dog food and when me talk, me not take it back. Me never name dog food in my yard. I mean I go to hospital go near no dog food. Me not go nowhere go eat no dog food. Big up to my father and my mother. We carry my breakfast and lunch and dinner come give me. Even though it's one visit you get. My father knew all the securities because I don't know him work at a plaza. So him just come and tell him if he bring up something let me get my breakfast, my lunch, my dinner, if my call him I must say. Because Peggy could only come one time for the day. If I call him and I say I want a sweetie, he walk from Upper Plaza come to hospital, carry come, come give me. At the end of the day, my father never did it in the first, in the first part. But, in the, for me, when I did just born, but he make up feed. Yes, when I'm pregnant, my father make up feed. Peggy, I'm a dear one, my number one, and the world know that. But yes, I wish part people deserve them credit, you give them them credit, right? Because... He never did it for me when me did a grow. Him coming in my life when me at 13. But you see me pregnancy, my father make up for that. My father make three, four trips per day. Everything when my feed van call him, him ask me for. He um, him carry them, come, come, give me every single thing. So I did not have to eat the food. I mean, never eat the food because the food don't look like it prepared properly. Them think most of the time, man in time, them send bread, come, come, give bread with sickness in my box and Oh, you have forced me for name that. She know. You don't want the food? And so she had give me attitude. So I turned to her and I said, no. But I'll take the tea for me to your man in time. She goes so. She cut her hair off of me. And she walk away and she go back with the food. Me nobody said nothing to her. Me just get my cut of me in my pee. And me not say nothing to her. Every man in this girl come. She cut her hair off of me. I remember when I tell you that she has a scale mackerel. I am a mother and a girl now compared to what they are. And I am she has a scale mackerel. I am a flash out of the hospital with she. And every morning she comes and the people say, You know her from a long time. I say, No, her from where I am a girl and buck up now. Because all of my mates stay good. All of my man ex them stay good. I want me to no stay good. All of my baby father ex them stay good. Right? All of my mates to them when I didn't know about stay good. I give them credit when they forget it. So if they want to and chat me, I don't care. Right? Because you don't chat you when you're important. All of my ex them. My man, all of my man ex them. Or if I'm still a grind them, we should have nothing to do with me. Stay good. So she's not my mate. And if my man sex, she couldn't even suck my toe. So them I say, you know, I say, no, friend, when I come to the hospital, because I know this girl and she tell us I don't want the hospital food. Because she'll go like her father cook it downstairs, or her mother prepare it. And she'll go like me and I share the same. Say, you know, them look over there, girl, I give me be attitude. Every man she come, she cut her eye off of me, and she, she walk past and she go on. And I say, any hour they push me, push down at this and recover me, map you down at this. I say, idiot girl, come here to address her, because I don't know me. I say, idiot girl, and my government tax me, can you? I see my government tax appear so I enter if say if I want the food, yes or no. When government draw tax out of my pay almost ten thousand dollars a month time. Education tax, this a tax, that the tax are almost I say don't play with me. If me don't want the food, me don't want the food, don't come up in here and give me no attitude come in, take your map the floor. You see from my sister. When she comes she keep her head straight. Sometimes I have to straighten out people. Sometimes you have to straighten out people right through. I mean, straighten she out. Come that take her and map up everything down at that. Can you come and give me attitude for hospital food when me say me don't want? Me cannot eat it. Me don't have dog food. Me don't eat it. 
Some of them are dog here throw down back so give them if meat not in the them step past it. So my so my vegetable then give it big and chop down like me is a vegetarian. I want to them chop them up, them not steam them. Me if you eat that, me hear one woman attack say, Oh them fling this a food nine box, but you still are eating. Me not go complain come and go eat it. She was my worst experience down at the hospital. Every morning, Mr. She may have to bite my lips and close my eye like my hand have good sex. It's true. She had me out now, my chest a dirt bones to owe me ignorant for she. And she come man in you now, I'm glad when they did she change her. That was my worst experience down at the hospital. My experience at Spanish Town Hospital, I'll give them. 80 out of 100 days for all them treat me me no no bona at a body them treat me good sometime in a life is how you treat people them treat you and how you react every reaction give a every action gives off a reaction based on how you react them treat you based on how you address them sometimes you have to address people politely i don't know or maybe people spirit just get with mine i don't know them never treat me bad so me not go drag them my experience first time at hospital and first time at spanish town hospital i give them 80 out of 100 why me take for the 20 was the girl when me da go map her down there me da go map down your whole antenatal ward with her down there she made me take off the 20. okay so guys that was my experience at spanish town hospital let me know if you want other story time I want to ask the question them and I give one of them. Ask me the question them about the pregnancy and we give one of them because Yala recover now, we know. Thanks be to God, Yala recover. I'm feeling much better. So thank you guys for watching. Remember to like, share, subscribe. Share it. Subscribe, like and comment. Okay? Click the notification bell so you can be notified anytime a post comes. I go live. Anytime soon, I'm not telling you when I come live.